what is up guys and welcome back to another VGC 2019 Ultra Series team testing and today I am gonna be making a team uh, with uh, what is, what's it called Brooks uh, wait Bru Brooks ish I'm not sure if that's how you call it but yeah I ran into someone running this uh, mon this is the only that's the only time I've ever seen anybody using this thing and I did not know that it has an ability similar to Serena's uh, what's it called? The, um, the Queen's Majesty or whatever it's called that protects your Pokemon from priority moves. So, Bruxish has Dazzling. While this Pokemon is active, allies are protected from opposing priority moves. But, I think the difference between uh, this one and uh, Queen's Majesty is that uh, Serena's, I think, protects all of your Pokemon, while this one only protects your allies. So, I think that Bruxish... Can still get hit with like priority moves, so fake out and pranks and stuff like that can still affect it. So that kind of sucks. But the whole reason why I'm gonna run it is because we can put after you on it. And I'm pretty sure people are gonna think that this thing is gonna be more for trick room. So I don't think though yeah, it does it learns trick room. So I don't think they're gonna see the whole uh, after you come in because I wanna run I wanna run this and bring back my Oranguru with my dual primals uh, the ones with the negative nature because even though they're negative nature and have zero investment in speed because of after you they'll be able to outspeed anything because I'm gonna run choice scarf on this thing this thing is just meant for after you so let's see and I have no idea what else I'm gonna run on this I don't even know what other moves it gets uh, trick room there's no point for trick room because I already have Oranguru for trick room um, but yeah, um, I ran into someone, they, were, they ran it alongside a Primal Kyogre. And that's when I thought about running this with my dual Primals. Since uh, it doesn't matter how much speed investment I have in my Primals, they'll still have speed because of this. But let's see... Liquid... Ooh, Liquidation, not bad. I mean, I, don't, I highly doubt I'll ever use Liquidation or any other moves. Pretty much the main thing I'm going to be using is After You. You can learn ally switch. Hmm, can this thing learn final gambit? No. Ooh, crunch. Ooh, disable. I think yeah, I think we'll go with that. Um Jolly, max speed. Max speed, max attack. Wow, your stats are really low. HP, defense, special defense, pretty weak. And then we bring in the primals. So th these are going to be negative uh, speed nature primals. And I never run Origin Pulse on Kyogre. Usually I just go Water Spell, Skull, Ice Beam, or Thunder. But since I'm going to have I'm going to have Gravity on Oranguru, I'll run Origin Pulse. I mean, probably having Water Spell and Origin Pulse might not be the best idea, considering. Uh, I think should we go Ice Beam? I think Ice Beam. Considering that uh, if I run into something with wide guard, that could end up being a problem. Do, 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 do. Okay, so minus speed plus uh, special attack. Let's see, which one's that one? Where is it at? Oh, there it is, there it is. Plus special attack, minus speed. Just max everything out, max out the HP for that, uh, max out the HP for the, um, what's called, for the water spout. And then zero, because we want this Kyogre to be really slow. Next one is Groudon. Because I love running uh, negative speed nature Groudon uh, with Trick Room, Gravity, or Anger for Instruct. It's it's so good if you can get up the Sword Dance and Gravity and all that stuff. Red Orb. Crestless Blades, Sword Dance, Fire Punch, Protect. 
Brave Nature with zero speed IVs. What was I running on my Groudon? I think it was just max HP, I think. And then, of course, Oranguru. Uh, and if this is your first time watching the Oranguru that I've used before, uh, this one, I run speed investment on it because I want it to... Uh, I want Groudon to be slower in Trick Room. So I can go for, like, Precipice Blades, and then Oranguru goes for Instruct. And usually I run a 50% berry, but I think I'll try inner, uh, inner. I think I'll try mental herb with this one. And let's see, trick room, gravity, instruct, and protect. And I think I was running a physically defensive Oranguru. Max defense, and then 16 special defense, because Oranguru has a nice special defense stat. Alright, so Primal's Oranguru, Bruxish with After You. We need a Z-Mover. Let's see, yeah, yeah, Incineroar is better. Because I can go with Incineroar or Oranguru. Intimidate, Fake Out. Now, okay, now I'm noticing that Amoongus is a problem for this team if I get Trick Room up because Amoongus is just going to outspeed all my Pokemon. So, it's because, but, but I also want to run a Mega because I want to bring back Mega Mawile because that thing, Mawile does not get enough love. Do I want to go Protect or do I want to go U Turn? I think I'm going to go U Turn. And then Adamant. So I kind of want to go either a Tapu, so like Tapu Coco or Tapu Fini, because Amoongus could be a problem. But at the same time, I also want uh, Mawile because it's it's a pretty good threat for uh, Xerneas. I think I'll just try out Mawile. If Amoongus uh, does become a problem, then uh, probably I'll get I'll get rid of it and bring uh, probably like Tapu Fini or Tapu Coco. Sucker Punch, just Sucker Punch, Play Rough, Iron Head, Protect. So yeah, in case, in case Amoongus does become a problem, I think I'll probably get rid of Mawile. Or I could just get rid of, Inc I could, actually I could switch out Incineroar. And bring in Electrium Z Tapu Coco. Terrain helps me out with the Moongus. It can get Volt Switch. Hmm, that's another possibility right there. But for right now, I think I'm gonna just uh, use a team like this. <laughs> Alright, boys, here we go. Bruxish. But hopefully, my opponents just expect, like, um, okay, they have a stack attack, so, uh, what's it called? Uh, Wide Guard? Groudon, Evelta, Salamence, Venusaur, Tapu Koko, and Stack Attack. So Trick Room's really good here. I would like to go Incineroar and Mawile, but then that that Groudon is going to be a problem because I'm pretty sure he's going to he's going to bring these two. Salamence, Stack Attacka or Tapu Koko? Do I want to just go straight up Trick Room here? Uh, the stack attack is the problem because of that wide guard. I think I'm gonna go trick from here. 
Incineroar, Ranguru with Groudon, and then, uh... Mawile? I think Mawile. Yeah, Evelta and Salamence, okay. So Groudon, probably stack attack it in the back. Alright, so Trick Room, and let's uh, fake out the Veltal. Alright, we're gonna Protect, and we're gonna U-Turn out. Alright, so he has Stack Attacka, and he has Groudon in the back. Then again, getting up the gravity would be pretty good, but oh, he probably has wide guard, doesn't he? Probably does. Okay, this gravity, and you turn out. He went for foul play! What the heck? Okay, so let's protect right here and sword dance. Or you know what? Uh he could he could still have it. I'm afraid of the wide guard, dude. I really am. But he has rock slide. Okay, he's just going for rock slide. He's hoping for flinches. Whoa! Oh, what the heck? Oh, I messed up with the Rangru. No, 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 no. Oh, I messed up. Ah, oh, no, that's not the spread. It's supposed to be 12. Um. Oh, I messed up with the spread, bro. I messed up with the spread. I messed up. Dude, I lost. I messed up. I forgot to... I forgot about the speed investment. I forgot about the speed investment, dude. We knocked out Stack Attack and Evelta, but Trick Room's already almost gone. And he has Groudon and his elements in the back. Yeah, I messed up. I'm just gonna double switch out. I lost, dude. I messed up. Because he's probably just gonna double protect right here. Uh... Nah, he's not gonna protect. Oh my god, yeah, I lost. I messed up, man, I messed up. I think this is what I had 12 and 48. Yeah, because you saw right there. I went for Instruct, but Aranguru was slower than Groudon, so it didn't work. I would've knocked out the, um... I would've knocked out the, what's it called? Evelta and the Stack Attacker right there. Ah, oh, I messed up. I'm so mad at myself, dude. Uh, this guy is, uh... Does he know what he's doing right now? He knows he's in Ultra Series, right? Another Pokemon that could have Wide Guard. Pretty annoying. Kyogre. Bro, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go Bruxish and Kyogre. We're gonna go after you right here. But then again, I'm pretty sure you're probably gonna bring the, uh, the Aerodactyl. Alright, you know what? I think we just go Incineroar and uh, let's get Trick Room up. I've got Mental Herb anyway. And Groudon and Mawile. Ah, dude, I'm so mad at myself, man. I put the 60 in uh, special defense for a Ranguru. Thunderous and Ferrothorn, so uh, let's go for Flare Blitz and Trick Room. Let's 
Switch out to Groudon and get Gravity up. Uh, actually, I could just... Mm, I could Z-move the Thunders, but I think, uh... I think I'll U-turn in Gravity. I wonder why he's only running one Restricted Mon. Yeah, but that other battle, I would have knocked out his stock attacker and his Eveltar right there. And then we still had to trick him up. And uh, I think even at minus one, two Precipice Blades will be enough to knock out. Um, will be enough to knock out his, what's it called? Just gonna go Precipice Blades and Instruct. Uh, two Precipice Blades would have been enough to knock out the Groudon, even at minus one. Okay, this guy's running Tox. Oh my god. Orang oh, oh, oh Rangaroo is slower. I forgot about that. Rangaroo is slower. Because of the... Because I got paralyzed. Running Toxic on a Ferrothorn. That's multi scale Lugia. But there's no way you have that. In the real game, there's no way you have it. He's just gonna protect right here. Yeah, he's going to have to protect. We're such on Incineroar, and we'll protect uh, Orangru. Okay, so we don't knock, we were, we were going to knock out your Lugia then. Alright, Fake Out, Thunderous, and Trick Room. Actually, you know what? Screw the Fake Out. Let's go for a Z move on Lugia. No, 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 you're just gonna roost up again, yeah. Fake out the Lugia and Trick Room. We have Mental Herb, so he can go for he can go for the Taunt. Okay, I'll take that. Alright, uh, I'm just gonna Z move Lugia and we switch on to Mawa. You don't have multi scale. You don't have multi scale. You don't have multi scale. Okay, Lugia is just a bulky beast. <laughs> Call mine, Lugia. You do not see Lugia at all in the Ultra Series, bro. That really sucks. You do not see Lugia at all. All right, we're just gonna U-turn the Lugia and we Iron Head the Aerodactyl. Yeah, I don't think he's running protect on the Lugia. Oh, the Lugia actually survived. Yeah, he doesn't have Protect on it. Um, oh no, we're slower, we're slower, yeah. Just get Gravity up, and we'll play rough the Lugia. Yeah, he's just protecting uh, Thunderous. Alright, actually, I think uh, Gravity helps out play rough, doesn't it? Because now I can just instruct Mawile. He's just hoping for hacks, bro. Are you serious right now? Get out of here, dude. I can't believe you actually got it. Alright. Trick Room and Play Rough the Lugia. Critical hit, by the way! Mawala still took it. Of course. Of course. Of course. Trick Room and Sucker Punch. If you attack, we knock you out. Of course! Get paralyzed! Just end this, please! Okay, so this this could have probably been like 2-0 right here. The first battle too, but I messed up. 
and I didn't put the right spread on Oranguru, and Oranguru outspin my Groudon. Alright, but let's see if I can get Bruxish with the After You. They have their own Kyogre, Amoongus. Oh, there it is, Amoongus. There it is. Kyogre, Rayquaza, you're going to bring those two. Incineroar, Amoongus, I could see that. Maybe even Lando. Two Intimidators, by the way. Here's the problem. Okay, that's probably Tectonic Rage Lando. I kind of just want to go Bruxish and Kyogre here. You know, we know you bring Rayquaza and Kyogre. The other two has to be Amoongus, and I'm looking at Amoongus, Lando, or Incineroar. So let's go Kyogre, Bruxish. With Incineroar, and I think we go Groudon. I don't think we bring Trick Room here because of the Amoongus. Rayquaza and Landorus, okay. Okay, so I don't, he's not gonna see. I don't think he's gonna see it coming. He's not gonna see it coming. After you and Water Spout. He's gonna get rid of the rain, but. Later, Lando! We just got rid of uh, his Z-Move user, pretty much. Um, okay, that's Choice Banded. That's Choice Banded Rayquaza, by the way. By the way, by the way. Okay, uh... Switch on to Groudon and fake out the Rayquaza. That's a Choice Banded Ray, dude! Completely destroyed my Kyogre! Alright, switch on to Bruxish. Oh, I can't protect! He didn't- bro, he didn't even bring the Amoongus, I could've just gone Trick Room. GG. He didn't even bring the Amoongus, I could've just gone Trick Room. Choice Bandit Rayquaza just destroyed my Kyogre. Yeah, dude. Max HP, it destroyed me. So, okay, so right there, you saw how Amoongus was kind of a problem. It kind of made me, like, not want to bring Trick Room, even though he didn't even bring it. But here we go. This guy's running uh, Evelta, Xerneas, uh, Tapu Fini, Incineroar, Manectric. I kind of want to do it again, bro. I kind of want to do it again. I want to do it again, dude. I want to do it again. Bruxish and Kyogre, and then we'll go Oranguru and Groudon in the back. I don't know. So maybe I might have to switch something out and bring, like, a Tapu Koko or Tapu Fini. Okay, I wonder if he knows about my ability. I'm just gonna go after you and Water Spout. Cause he can still fake out the Bruxish. That kinda sucks, dude. I wish he just protected everybody. Oh, oh my god, you actually took that? Yeah, of course you're Snarl. Of course you're Snarl. He's gonna protect. He's gonna protect Yvelta. Yep, of course. Ah, uh, he took the modest freaking water spout, dude. He's mad. He's mad. 
He's mad mad. He's mad mad. Uh, trick room. And let's go on to Groudon. Oh, I'm going for Moonblast. Mental hurt, baby. Let's go for gravity, and uh, I think I'm just gonna. He's gonna switch in Incineroar, so let's just go for press of his blades. Yeah, I could have gone for Swords Dance, but. We already got the gravity up anyway. Alright, uh, we switch out into Kyogre. And, uh, let's, uh... He's gonna fake out Groudon, though. Ranguru can't do anything anymore. Switch out to Kyogre and protect Groudon. Origin Pulse and Precipice Blades. Yeah, so the Moongus might actually end up being a problem for this team. But I think I'll just stick with the team like this and just try and play around it for right now. Like, that guy didn't even bring the, um... That guy didn't even bring, uh, what's it called? Um, the Amoongus. And this one that Evelta took that modest water spout, bro. The Evelta was able to take that modest water spout from a primal Kyogre. And let's see, Smeargle, get that thing out of my life. Ferrothorn, Mewtwo, Kyogre, very weird looking team actually. Okay, so we got Smeargle too now. Smeargle is actually pretty annoying. Because Smeargle can, ha Smeargle can have the, uh... Mm, yeah, Smeargle can have it too. Smeargle can have Spore. Let's see, Kyogre, they probably lead off Smeargle, Kangaskhan or something like that. I like Bruxish and Kyogre. They probably bring Ferrothorn though. Let's see. I gotta go in Sonora. Sonora Oranguru with Groudon and then Mawal. I gotta get Trick Room up. Me too, and Kangaskhan. Okay, never mind. No Smeargle? Alright, uh, let's switch on to Groudon and Trick Room. That could be Roar Kangaskhan, but whatever. Okay, so I forgot about Smeargle and its Spore, so that's another problem actually for this team. Going straight for the double edge, okay. Let's get Swords Dance up. Gravity up. 
Because he might switch out Kangaskhan into Kyogre if he has it. So, Mewtwo, Ferrothorn, Kangaskhan. I don't think he brought... Yeah, he didn't bring uh, Smeargle. Sweet. That's all I needed. That's all I needed. That's all I needed. P-Blades and uh, Instruct. Unless he's running a negative speed nature Kyogre too, then this is a speed tie. Uh, King, he's got King's Con and Mewtwo in the back. And Sonora actually outspeeds speeds now, so our fake out is priority. Well, not priority, but our fake out is gonna go first. Precipice Blades and fake out King's Con. You see, if I can get Swords Dance up in Trick Room, it's uh, pretty much GG from there. Focus Sash Mewtwo, what the heck? With Water Pulse? Water Pulse Mewtwo, what the heck is going on? Alright guys, uh, well, hope you guys enjoyed. There was the first battle. I really feel like I would have won that one, but I forgot to switch uh, Oranguru's uh, speed. I didn't put speed investment in Oranguru, so Oranguru was actually slower than Groudon under Trick Room, which isn't good. Um, but you saw the battle that I lost against that one guy that had the Amoongus, because I didn't want to bring Trick Room, and he didn't, he didn't even bring the Amoongus. So yeah, I, I'm looking at one of these two to switch out to switch out. If if like Amoongus or Smeargle continue to be a problem because of Spore, then I think I think one of these two has to go. Either Tapu Fini or Tapu Coco would really help out. But anyway guys, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys again next time.